midst and land somewhat out of reach lies a gate, a gate of shining silver. You approach the gate and it slowly opens. Far away you notice mountains, hills, and forests. There are even villages beyond. You look to the sky and there is a city. Legend says it was a city forged by the god of all as a gift to humanity, or maybe as a curse. Welcome to the land below the clouds. Ladies and gentlemen, may we please have silence. Please quiet down now. Many of you have heard of the recent destruction of Clarum's forces at the hands of the shadow wielder Tenebris. Quiet. Listen. Clarum's forces were the only defense we placed for Port Rio. After their defeat, he will gain control of the port. We will lose a huge amount of our food supply and other resources for our city. We are sure he will take over Port Rio and force the people to be under his power. We do not know what Tenebris is specifically after, but we can assume it is nothing good for this fair city. If Tenebris is powerful enough to take on four individual squadrons of our finest soldiers on the battlefield, who knows how powerful he can become? For now, return home and may the great god of all be upon you. This is the Regal's words. Adjourned. What do you think, Forsta? I've never seen Tenebris go on direct assaults like this. He's always kept his distance from the city and its resources. His attacks have always been in an effort to expand the Shadow Realm's borders. Seems a bit rash to immediately attack our main port. Hmm. Something is off. We may need to investigate this further. Wanna bet that's what the Regals are gonna ask us to do? Ah, Knight Borska and Kincaid. Just the man we wanted to see. It's always a pleasure. How may we serve you? We have a mission for you. Called it. What is the mission? We need you both to go to Puerto Rio to go- It's never said Shadow Troopers? No, Kincaid. We need you both to go on a stealth mission to see what Tenebris is doing. Where's the fun in that? We can't rush into Port Rio with an army of knights and soldiers. We need to know what his strategy is. It will be done, my regals. We knew we could rely on you. I vote for killing Tenebris before he kills us. It's better than doing nothing. Reconnaissance isn't nothing. Because traveling somewhere to sit around and wait is really something. If you are so adamant on being useful, I can always have you clean the sleeping chamber. I guess I'm okay with doing nothing. I better prepare for the mission. I'll meet you at the tower. And tell your cousin hello for me, will you? Of course! Callister! Hey, cousin, catch! <laughs> now, what is this? Sky's candy, finest you can get. Thanks, Carl. What's going on? About to go on an important mission where we sneak around and see what the enemy is up to. You're not fighting anyone? Sounds boring. Oh, trust me, it is. But it's for the benefit of the people, as stated by Forsta and the Regals. Well, don't be too long. We still need to practice sword fighting. I've been working on my parry all day. Don't worry, I won't be long. Was that Knight Kincaid? He's so cool! One day, I'm gonna be just like him.
Oh, am I late? For once, no. And as always, I'm early. Congratulations. You should win an award. <laughs> Maybe so. So where are we headed? We're headed to Riverport Center. We should be able to find something there. Sounds eventful. What's with the crowd? Looks like... Shh. Be quiet. <laughs> that laugh. A very distinct laugh. Wait. Listen. People of Port Rio, you have been mistreated for too long. The sky dwellers ask for food, supplies, and the fruit of your labor only goes to a select few. So what do you gain in return? Nothing. That is why I call you to defend your rights and end your suffering. I call you to revolution. 